Well, good morning, everybody. It's bright and early here on a Monday, September 30. Wow, October's just, uh, you know, several hours away already. What's going on? But man, it's been a long uh, several days, as you probably, you know, noticed. And uh, just so happens after, you know, all the dust settles and the smoke clears, uh, here, you know, here they are again in a situation where they need uh, some transportation. So I'm going to just go pick up Faye and Mark so they can uh, do some laundry and take a shower before they jump in the ride service vehicle to get down to, uh, you know, see their four children. You know, all youngins, you know, I think eight, the eight year old is the oldest. I think it's three, five, seven, and eight. Anyway, but I did make the kids some special, uh, you know, lunch bags. Thanks to my friend Angela, it, it will and others. But they, uh, you know, they're going to be, you know, feeling the pain of, you know, their their family pet died, and they're, you know, hundreds of miles away from their parents, and they're in a strange town, strange people, strange school, just kind of a rough deal, so I'm just going to give these guys a ride real quick, and, uh, and then go about my normal business, well I guess this is my normal business, but uh, first things first, I got to go pay my P.O. box, <laughs> otherwise uh, today's the last day, so uh, I'm five minutes away, so I'm going to make it happen. And uh, we'll be back soon, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Look at this young fella chilling in his in his dom his domicile. Hey, buddy. How you doing, man? Are you gonna be like the Hudsons and be chained up forever? Yeah. Sorry, good buddy. You're a handsome little fella. I would ask her name, but you probably couldn't tell me. Look at that face. Okay. Whoa. You got plenty of grub over there. Are you having a good day? Well, you're a strong one, Mr. Grinch. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. We did it. Good today. Two bags. Well, as you can see, I had to clean out my car. That dog scratched me. I'm bleeding. What dog? Uh, that dog. You want a Band-Aid? Oh, no. I, I got this. Um, but like I said, I got limited room. And... Uh, so, throw whatever you got here in the trunk. This can go front way. And we'll get over there so you can shower and do your laundry. And it's visiting day, obviously. So. Yeah. I guess you'll go by the bank. What's his name? Hey, Charles. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I gotta go see the kids. Yeah, long day. Dope, man. Have a good All right. Have a All right. Day. Thanks, buddy. Oh, and good job on that video. Oh, well, thank you. And I even seen you put Mr. Know It All in it. <laughs> Which one's that? Uh, the one we just left. Um, I got a special gift for you. Oh, boy. I can't tell you what it is yet. It's a big secret until we get to our destination. Oh, you're running cam, never mind. <laughs> I'm what? You're running the camera, never mind. <laughs> I, oh, we didn't lose it. Of course. Can I have a cigarette? I get, I get beat up by a knife. Right, this one right here in front, in the front seat. Daryl, can I pretty please have a cigarette? Yeah. You know, I made you, I made your kids some special lunches because, uh, did they even know about Shiloh? No. I didn't think so because you can't contact them. All right, well, 
I don't know that I'm telling him until I get his ashes. Well, I guess that's up to you. But at the same time, I figured, uh, you know, I made them, you know, the four of them, a, a special, uh, you know, a treat bag. So they don't have to fight over ours? <laughs> well. <laughs> they were fighting. It was funny. No, that's my orange. No, that's my orange. So Leland, the littlest one, grabs the orange and runs to the uh, de facto opener, uh, worker to get her to open it so he can eat it. <laughs> Those, they're little. Those are hard to open. They're actually mandarins. He is so funny. He's just a trick. And they're three, five, seven, and eight. Yeah, they will be three, five, seven, and eight. We let them turn four in March. The picture of Mariah in the background holding him up. That's the night we got him. I woke all the kids. I got him at like one o'clock in the morning. That's when the guy brought him to us. Boy, he was all fuzzy and young, and he was a bad. He was so so sweet and snuggly, and he. Uh, I woke all the kids up to so, so they could see him, and Leela looks at me and says, "Nice puppy, can I have ice cream?" <laughs> so let me tell you what happened yesterday. So I went in the laundry mat and I put my card in. Right, this is you're something, another customer, valued customer, or something. Here's ten dollars for your wash, so it only actually cost me like five dollars to wash. Nice. So I was, I was, yeah, that worked. So it was kind of like a, a gift, a perk. Yeah, like, but I still don't, I still haven't found that money. Well, you know, that's, that's uh, whatever. Yeah, I mean, I'm not, I, I have no answers on that. <coughs> okay. Oh, just drove over the thing. Okay, All right, why don't you go in and find out what's going on with, uh, you know, scheduling and that type of thing. You said there's always a list. All right, guys, is there anything in the trunk that you that you didn't bring in? You should probably get that bank that the belt lengthened. It's it's only going to wrap around you twice now. It's only big as a, I should be as big as a fuck. Uh, yeah. All right. He eats more than anybody I know. So he gets up in the morning eating and goes to sleep with something in his hand, probably. Yeah. And you know how many times I find cookie crumbs in my bed? I didn't do it. Okay. He didn't do it. Didn't well, do check it. this out. The yeah. other day, when we were at the park, you know, you were working long hours at the... Uh, the trailer next door, you know, with flooring and trying to do plumbing and yeah. et cetera, et cetera. And you said you were pretty sore. And you had mentioned a medication that you use. What was the name of that? Uh, I remember. It was a creamy rub on your body? Oh, Blue Stop. Blue Stop? Okay. Well, I certainly, I have a friend. Her name's Teresa. I got a couple different Teresas. Teresa B and Teresa F. And Teresa B had sent you a full bottle. Oh, yes. Oh, tell her. Oh. Thank you. Of the blue thank stop. You. you can tell her yourself. You got to look thank directly. You. Thank you. Yeah. I love it. I just got it in the mail. Um, and I thought I had, it's a long story. I thought I had lost it. But in the meantime, there's been, let me get you what I got for your, for your kids. What do you say, Joey? What up, brother? How you doing? Not too bad, not too bad. What's up, you two? How you doing? They're, uh, they're still there. You know, on occasion. We'll get it fixed. All right, what check this out. For? All four of these lunches are, are equivalent. Okay. And there's, there's multiple snacks <laughs> and uh, peanut butter and jelly with a spoon in there so they can make their own <laughs> concoction. <laughs> and uh, there's a, also a, a little sweet treat at the end, a little Hershey's Kiss. Oh, okay. And I will tell them. The mouth you. size. Okay. Well, hopefully you can get some video on it. Yeah. You know, I don't know if you want to try to close it up or, oh. or do whatever. Joking, man. All right. So you got the, the blue stop. You guys got lunches for the kids, and everything else is going to be good from here. You're going to be able to, you know, do your uh, 
it's laundry at this point because you can't get to the shower thing. Well, hey, there's that. You know, we're you're here. Good. And they're going to be here in an hour and a half or so. Fantastic. All right, give me some. I thought Thank the you. kids, I, I didn't know if you were going to tell the kids or not, but I thought that might cheer up their day. You know, some little, you know. I, that's a thought. I, I got three hours to think about. Yeah. yeah. Well, you told me, you know, a day or two ago that it's like you're not going to lie to them. So I, I'm not. If they ask me, yeah, I'll tell them. But if they don't, I, I'm. I don't know that that's not gonna make Mariah go into one of her like a spell. Yeah, because yeah. she's autistic. No, I get it. And it's I, uh, uh, Mariah. It, it could be a trigger for. It could, it could cause more harm than good. Mm -hmm. It's obviously not going to cause any good, but it's the fact is that you're being honest with them. But like you said, you got hours to think about it because mm -hmm. you got you know basically a billion miles to go. And uh, what's progress on the on your moving thing over there at the trailer? Is that even going to be possible, or is that I just is I that just smoke and mirrors? I think. Never mind. We're on camera. Well. Uh, Wouldn't that be a good thing to do is be on camera and let it be known? Uh, you know, you know, I mean the facts are the facts. I, I don't know what he's doing one minute He needs this and then he, he's gonna go find it and then he runs off and he's nowhere to be found for four five six hours And but he wants you to get up at two o'clock in the morning and go help him do the flooring Are you ready for me? Okay all right, guys. I'm gonna run some errands. You know, I, I got a I got a day planned as well. I was gonna go to the car wash, but they're closed for maintenance. And I look, it's a mess. Is it sat in my driveway for three, four days as I was driving you guys around in my mom's car, which she wasn't happy about, but she'll get over it. You know, I'll make her some toast. You know, it'll be cool. It's like, yeah. You know, those I think you're I think the kids are gonna dig those lunches. Yes, so, they are. Yeah. Don't be snacking on them on the way. I yes you will. <laughs> Alright guys. Man just lost her pet hundreds of miles away from her kids. Today's visiting day. We're just a couple days removed of the of the uh, tropical storm. We got the tropical storm part, obviously nowhere near as devastating as it was in multiple regions. North Carolina got spanked, Florida got spanked, as you know. And my friend Victoria sent me a, a deal on my email last night about a chemical explosion, chemical plant type thing. I guess that's been contained. That's in Conyers, Conyers, Georgia, which is quite a ways from me but there was toxic you know toxic uh ventilation and and smoke and fumes you know released into the air so i hope they're doing okay it's like what's going on here you know is this the apocalypse all right i gotta get to work long day ahead